so PCA can also be looked at minimizing the risk construction error so again let's assume we have n data points x1 x2 to xn and each of the xi is belong to rk and we have to find a vector u belonging to rk so that magnitude of u is 1 and we have to find the vector u such that if we project xi on u that is these projected points so and we project these points back so we get n scalars and if we project these scalars back into k-dimensional space such that these scalars uh, represent the length in direction of vector u so the reconstruction error means the distance between the projected points so the so when we project back we get the following vectors u into u transpose x1 u into u transpose x2 you can see that u is k cross 1 and u transpose xi is 1 cross 1 hence u into u transpose xi is k cross 1 therefore these are the projected points so u into u transpose xn and distance between these points which are projected back into the k dimension space and the original points xi is it should be the minimum so we have to minimize this so reconstruction error is the error between these projected points and the original points so the distance between original and the projected points is the error so xi minus u u transpose xi and the magnitude of this represents the error and we have to minimize this error by taking average of error in all the data and data points and we have to show that the resulting formulation is the same as we obtained in the previous video so minimizing this is equivalent to minimizing the square of this so we can write this as so since 1 by n is constant we can drop that and we'll minimize and this can be written as so basically if we have a vector k dimensional vector a1 a2 ak let's say we have a vector a then magnitude of a square is simply a1 square plus a2 square plus a3 square plus up to ak square and this can also be written as a transpose into a because a transpose a would be nothing but a and a2 into ak multiplied by a1 a2 to ak and this if you multiply do the matrix multiplication here you will get a1 square plus a2 square and so on so we'll use the same formula here So this would be sigma i is equal to 1 to n xi minus u u transpose xi transpose into and we'll use a plus b transpose is equal to a transpose plus b transpose which will give us this xi transpose u u transpose so we have to minimize this which is equivalent to minimizing this expression xi transpose xi minus xi transpose u u transpose xi minus xi transpose u u transpose xi plus xi transpose u u transpose u u transpose xi now this term here does not depend on u so can be ignored and these two terms are same and we can note that since xi transpose u is equal to u transpose xi and this is a scalar so this expression can be think of as multiplication of two scalar quantities 
and similarly here we have two scalar quantities and we can shift these scalar quantities anywhere we want so this can be written as sigma is equal to 1 to n so we have to minimize this expression now minus 2 times u transpose xi square plus u transpose u into u transpose xi square and we know that magnitude of u is 1 and u transpose u, u is again scalar and its value should be 1. So we have to minimize this minus times sigma i is equal to 1 to n u transpose xi square which implies we have to maximize this expression maximize sigma i is equal to 1 to n u transpose xi square such that magnitude of u is 1 and we have to find a direction u in the following way and if you note it carefully it is nothing but it is same as variance of x size when projected on vector u so this reduces to the just the same case that is maximizing the variance uh, if we assume that sigma xi 1 2 and average of sigma xi is 0 that is they are mean centered which implies sigma of u transpose xi from 1 to n would be also 0 so if you assume that this is nothing but variance of the projected points and this reduces to the previous case which we just discussed in the previous video and hence it will also uh, using the steps in that video it will be reduced to maximizing u transpose sigma u so the magnitude of u is 1 and sigma is 1 upon n sigma xi into xi transpose so this sigma is summation and this sigma is a symbol so let me bold it to make the distinction and this represents the summation here so so this is how we can see that uh, the objective function of minimizing the reconstruction error as defined here is same as maximizing the variance of is equivalent to maximizing the variance of projected points thank you and see you next video